Hello and welcome to Body Mind Soul TV. I'm Sol Walkling. I'm a Pilates instructor, a fitness model and journalist. I'm here in Manly in Sydney, Australia and I've put together a workout that's going to be quite full on, 15 minutes that's going to work your abs, your legs and your arms, giving you that cinched in waist that all Pilates instructors have. So let's get stra started straight away, let's get into it. <sighs> Lie down onto your back, on your mat, with your feet on the mat, about sit bone distance apart. Arms are reaching by the sides. And find your neutral pelvis, gently flattening the lower back and then arching it the other way, settling it in your neutral. Now let's get started with the ab work. Arms come by the behind the head, elbows sailed wide, shoulders away from the ears. Take a deep breath in. On the exhale, draw the belly button in towards the spine, flatten the lower back and curve the upper body forwards and up. Nice flat abs here. Inhale to hold, nice long neck as well. On the exhale, deepen that ab contraction and slowly lower it back down. We're doing that four more times. Inhale to stay. On the exhale, sinking the belly button, lifting it forwards and up, shoulder blades come off, elbows wide. Hold it for breath in, really sucking in that navel. On the exhale, lower it back down. Three more times. Inhale, exhale, curve it forwards and up. Shoulder blades lift all the way. And exhale, drawing it down and in and lowering it back down. Last two. Come forwards and up on your exhale. Hold it, and exhale, lower it back down. Last one, we're staying up. On the exhale, we curve it forwards and up. Hold it, flattening the lower back. On the exhale, bring the legs to tabletop. Inhale, stay here, lift. On the exhale, tap both feet down to the floor. Inhale to lift. Strong core, drawing the belly button in, lower back is flattened. We've got four more. Three more, come up a little bit higher if you can. Last two, last one, going straight to our oblique work, stay up if you can, exhale, reach the right leg out, inhale, draw it back in, left leg reaches and back in, keep that going, if you're adding on, bring the upper body across, right elbow to left knee and then reverse, over and over, now pick up the tempo, go over and over for nine, Nine, eight, seven, six, five, lift the shoulder blades off, draw the belly button in, three, two, last one, come all the way back to centre, don't lower it down just yet, ten little pulses forwards, draw the navel in, shoulder blades lift for six, five, four, three, two, one, lower it all the way down, hug the knees into the chest briefly, then place the feet straight onto the mat. We're going to our hip rolls. Arms come by the sides, palms facing down. Inhale to prepare. On the exhale, curve the spine off the mat, drawing the navel down and in, lifting it all the way. Inhale to hold it here. Exhale to lower it back down, placing it down one vertebra at a time here. Just two more, then we're adding on. Exhale to curve it off. Finding that long line where it feels as if someone's drawing your knees away from you. On the exhale, curve it back down. Last one. Rolling up, slowly and with control. Hold it. And then curve it back down, adding in the legs. If this is enough for you, you can stay with that. Exhale, curve it all the way up. Inhale, exhale, stay. Find a steady base with the feet. Tighten the glutes, squeeze it. On the next inhale, the right leg lifts all the way up to the sky. Exhale, flex the foot and lower it down. Inhale to lift, keep the pelvis nice and high. Exhale to lower. Last one. And place the foot down, other side. Inhale to reach the toes up. Exhale, flex the heel as you lower. Lift it up and lower. Last one, squeeze that right glute. Lower it down, place the foot down. On the exhale, slowly roll back down. Well done, <laughs> that was pretty full on. Draw the knees into the chest. We're going to somewhat ab work straight away. 
<clears throat> arms come out to the sides, palms facing down, extend the legs up to the sky, the legs are together, they can be gently bent if you're tight in the hummies. Everyone, reverse curls to start with. Inhale to prepare, draw the navel in. On the exhale, curve the back off the mat. Inhale, low. Exhale, feet go over to the right. Inhale, draw it back to center. Exhale, lift it up. Inhale, low. Exhale, over to the left with the feet. Keep the shoulders glued to the mat. Inhale, draw it back to center. Exhale to lift. Stay with that. This is going to really create that cinched and waisty after. So lift it high, drawing the navel in, and then go as far as you can without losing control. Draw it back to center. Moving on the exhales only. Stay with it. Keep the legs glued together and reach up. We've got three more. And up, two more. Over to the right. Draw it back to centre, lift it. Last rep here. Slowly back to centre, lift. And bend, gently bend the knees into the chest. If you thought we were done with the arms, we're not just yet. Reach the legs up to the ceiling again, to the sky. Hands come behind the knees. Take a deep breath in. On the exhale, curve the upper body forwards and up. Draw that navel in again, scooping it out. Shoulders away from the ears, open chest. Inhale to stay. On the exhale, sizzle the legs. Draw one leg towards you, the other one away. Inhale up to the sky. Exhale, scissor it. And go again. And inhale. Now add in two little pulses. Nice stretch through the back of the thigh. Draw the navel in, make sure it's not starting to bulge up. Last two. Stay with it. Last one. And lower it all the way down. We're going for our little rocks. Rocking it backwards and forwards. A bit hard here on the beach. Come all the way forwards to the front of the mat. Come onto your feet. Just need the mic. Hang on. Hands come in front of you. Plant them onto the floor. Take a breath in. On the exhale, lengthen the legs. Push the heels into the floor. Let the upper body relax forwards. Inhale to stay. On the exhale, curve it all the way up, slowly drawing in the waist, opening the chest, lengthening the neck, and then inhale, reach it up, look up. Exhale to circle. Go again, reach and circle. Keep that core nice and connected, glutes squeezing. Last one. Okay, ready for our squats. We're getting our heart rate up a bit and we're working the legs and the arms. Step the feet wide, so they're wider than shoulder distance. Your toes turn out about 45 degrees from your midline. Nice and even weight through the feet. Hands come onto the hips to start with, just to make it a bit more simple. Now tighten the glutes so the pelvis is nice and upright. Zip up the core, draw it up and in. Draw the shoulders back and down. Neck nice and long and relaxed and then inhale, lower it down for a squat, exhale, lift, sinking the tailbone down, lifting through the top of the head, stay with it, squeeze the glutes on the way up, work those thighs, keep the shoulders drawing back and down, waist drawing in, add in the arms, arms out to the sides, fingertips reaching away, make sure they're not just hanging there, you're reaching the arms out, working them, Keep breathing, really crucial here. Exhale on the way up, inhale on the way down. We're adding in a little bit more movement. If you want, you can keep it simple. If you're adding on, reach it forwards and open. Feels if you're hugging a tree, gentle bend in the elbow. Still reaching the fingertips away. Adding on again. We're going to lift the arms on the next one. Lift and lower and close and open. Stay with that sequence. Keep the chest open, shoulders drawing back and down. Working up quite a bit of a sweat here. Draw your attention to your core again. That navel is still drawing in. Now squeeze the glutes every time you lift. Squeeze it up. Four more sets. Three more. 
navel still connected, chest open. Last one. We're going to come all the way down on the next one. Keep the arms out to the sides. Going to little pulses. If you need to lower the arms at any point, you can bring them in front for genie arms. If you still got it, if you're still working the shoulders and arms, keep the arms out to the sides. And now sit down into the pelvis as low as you can. Sinking down, drawing the navel up and in. Whew. And we're going to slowly twist the upper body over to the right. Keep reaching the arms out. Open the chest to the side. Pelvis keeps facing the front. And hold it here. And come back to centre. Other side. Working the obliques. Draw the navel up and in. Squeeze the glutes. And come back to centre. Ten lower lifts, the Pilates jumping jacks. Lift it up and lower it, reaching the arms. Lift. Six more. Exhale on the way up. Last two. Last one. We're going to pulses again. Go all the way down. Tiny pulses. Now bring that left hand forwards and down so the palm faces in. Right hand over the head. Keep pulsing. And then lengthen that right side out. Shorten the left side of the waist. That top shoulder wants to go back. And you've got six. Five, four, three, two, one, center, other side. For six, five, four, three, two, one, center, inhale to stay. Exhale, lift that right heel up. Whew. Inhale to lower. Left heel lifts and lowers. Lift it up and lower it. Other side, adding in the arms if you'd like to add on. Reach the opposite hand up and up. Keep both sides of the waist nice and long. And feel that burning. Whew. For four more, slide the shoulders back and down, draw the navel in, squeeze the glutes, last two. Last one, center it, ten lower lifts. Lift it up, going to lower as low as he can. Lift, Whew. and lower. Eight more. Down and up. Draw your attention back to your core. Still connecting the abs, still drawing up on the pelvic floor. Last two. Last one. Lift it all the way up. Give it a bit of a shake. We've got a bit of a stretch, a little bit of a breather. Bring your feet onto the mat, about sit bone distance apart. A few shoulder rolls. Oh, that feels good right now. <laughs> Give the legs a bit of a shake. <laughs> and then stand nice and tall. Take a deep breath in. Wipe off the sweat. <laughs> Exhale to slowly curve it forwards and down. Letting the spine just unravel. We're going to our downward dog for a stretch and then to our plank. Bring the hands onto the mat. You can bend the knees if you need to. Walk them forwards. Shoulder distance apart and push back into your heels. Lifting the sit bones up towards the sky. Release the neck, give it a bit of a shake if it's feeling tense. Two more breaths here. Shoulders slide away from the ears. And then on the next exhale, squeeze the glutes, lower the pelvis down to your full plank. Hands come directly under the shoulders, neck in line with the spine, waist drawing in, make sure you're not dropping the pelvis or sticking the butt up. You're in a long line. And smile. <laughs> Getting a bit hard here at this stage. <sighs> Two more deep breaths. Last one. We're winding down. Knees come onto the mat. Hands reach forwards. Deep breath in. On the exhale, circle your hands back to your feet. Relax the shoulders forwards. Three deep breaths here. Just allowing the body to melt down into the mat. Feel that inhale deep into the ribcage. On the exhale, draw in the navel. Last breath. And then slowly roll up the spine on your exhale, sitting back onto your heels. If the shoulder's a bit off a roll, oh, almost done. Hands plant onto the mat, come onto your feet. Push the heels into the floor, lengthen the legs, upper body just cascades forwards. On the exhale, stack up the spine, stand nice and tall. Reach it out and up, inhale, 
Exhale to circle it wide. <laughs> Lift. And low. Last one. And circle it wide. And then just stand with your feet about sit bone distance apart. Give your shoulders another roll. And then close your eyes and feel into your body here. Feet are firmly planted into the floor. Buttocks are gently squeezing. Waist is drawing up and in. Chest open. The neck long and relaxed as we're being drawn up to the sky by the top of the head. Now stay still, but open your eyes. Feel into your body for another second or two. Just feel that length and strength through it. And give the shoulders a little bit of a roll. You can move the head from side to side. Shake out the arms, the legs. And then if you've gotten this sweaty and sandy as me, I'm covered in it, then let's go for a swim. I hope to see you next time on Body, Mind, Soul TV here in Manly.